and I hate that so raining and it doesn't look much better today yeah, and I'm pretty sure it will rain again so over there on the lake are so many boats many. looks like a race or something it's definitely coming to rain again pretty sure a couple of hours have gone by. It was raining the whole day, or almost the whole day. So I decided I'm gonna clean my booster port. Since I reached 100 kilometers, like today or yesterday. Um, and also I have the belt, I think it's the belt that makes some noise. Um, I have it already here. And the noise that it makes sounds like yeah. yeah, and I hate that. So, doing it the first time, so I have no idea what I'm doing. I wasn't even able to take the rear wheel off. Welcome to another tutorial for your second generation boosted board. In this video, we will cover how to replace your wheels. You will need a skate tool and your 3mm hex tool. Use your 3mm hex tool to remove the two black motor cap screws. Set these aside with your motor cap. tool to take off the axle nut and axle washer and place these aside. Remove your wheel and the drive belt using a rotating motion while pulling away from the drive train. Make sure you leave the axle spacer and the drive pulley washer in place on the axle. Next, grab your new drive wheel and place your drive belt around the wheel pulley. Replace the wheel on the axle and pull the belt hot over your motor pulley. Next, replace the axle washer and the axle nut. Finally, replace the motor cap over the motor and use your 3mm hex tool to reinstall the two motor cap screws. Insert the long end of the tool into the screw and use the short end to properly tighten. Now that covers how to replace your drive and front wheels. If you have any more questions, feel free to email us at service at boostedboards.com or give us a call Monday. Easy. It feels like I'm never gonna ride it again. It's really dirty. And now, what did you say? Easy. That's gonna be the thumbnail, I think. So, uh, the problem is, I think I can take this one out. Wet tissue, I'm gonna clean the inside of the wheel. But you have to be careful because of the bearings. So, and now it looks like new. We've got here these skid plates. 
which after a while will wear out and these are here to protect the belts from stuff like stones and other opticals on the streets um, and after a while you will have to exchange them let's put this stuff together again make sure you leave the axle spacer and the drive pulley washer in place on the axle I mean, what can't go wrong? Yeah. <laughs> okay, this one. And... Uh, yeah. And it gets darker and darker and darker. Board is cleaned. Everything seems to work. Now let's check if... Yeah, baby! Okay guys, yeah, hope you liked this video and see you soon.